Hey, you're watching Audi Fish. This is 20 Feb 2022, and I'm doing a quick highlight of catching this beauty. Went out for about an hour. Can't tell you the location, but I gave you enough clues. You probably figured it out. Uh, it is Virginia. I'm in the uh, Grafton side, this area over here. Um, awesome Bay Jump. Yeah, I've never been there. Um, yep, about to get started, about to get launched in while I run into this awesome truck. Yep, they were and still are an amazing sponsor of oh, yeah! Audi Fish. This is Yarkey's Roofing Company in Virginia. If you need a good roofing, hit them up. Um, they are amazing. Uh, yep, this is a quick arsenal that I use. I got, uh, of course, some spinners. I did two. This is one of the colors. The other one's hooked up on the line. But that uh, some bright reddish trues and a uh, crank bait. Some again, bright red. Um, going for the pre-spawn look at the moment. Picture some of the natural colors. Um, so starting off targeting all the banks, rocks, mm. you know, things like that. Uh, when that didn't work for the first 30 minutes, when I did a spinner and hit the secondaries outwards. Uh, again, it would have been two feet. Water and then ran into this beauty. Yup, that was an 18 and a half inch, uh, beautiful Virginia bass. Caught with that, uh, that's right there is a humdinger lure. Um, it was with a two to three foot uh, leader line, and oh my gosh, she was gorgeous. Uh, I, I was actually supposed to be out of the water about five minutes ago. I'm supposed to be on the road to go to uh, DC for my back surgery, and I just went out for a quick little fish. Um, was, again, I can barely fish this last whole year because of my knee surgery, back surgery, neck, etc. So <laughs> to to get out for an hour and land this beauty was just a great feeling. Um, had to measure it out. Uh, she was about 18. Yeah. And again, I'm not in a tournament right now. This is just a quick session, but I uh, wanted to get a quick look see what she was like. And man, what an amazing. And then boom, hit this 21 and a half beauty. Yup, it seriously was just an amazing. To, I'm starting to going in and I had to throw two more casts in the same area where I caught the last and sure enough, my luck hit this beauty. Yup, she is just a mouth. Oh my god, look at that. That belly, that chunk, that lips. Yup, I kissed her, I rubbed her. I freaking enjoyed every minute of her for that two minutes I had. Uh, yeah, I'm probably gonna get in trouble. I should have been on the road. This was my way of quarantine right here. I had to get out in the water. I had to do a couple cast. Took out my little kayak. That's a vibe skipjack. Had to rub her beautiful belly. Um, <laughs> give her some love. God, she's nasty. Thank she, you yep, very much. <laughs> God. Oh, she's just looking at that mouth. Uh, was not my PB. My PB is a 24 inch here in Virginia. Uh, but I thought she was pretty close at first. Um, she's just gorgeous. You never know. You never know. But, uh, yep, gonna give her a sexy look goodbye. Check my booty. Yep. Oh. Thanks for watching that part. Yeah, so this last little piece is just showing y'all what I used. Again, that's that humdinger spinner with two uh, wheel blades. It's a two to three foot liter line. That's a fluorocarbon, about 15, 20 pound. I'm pretty sure that's a 20 pound. I can't remember what I put on back in the day. And tie it with a double uni to a liter line. That's a uh, braid. And then it's with a uh, 13 fishing rod paired up with a Shimano reel. That's a, a sustain. And uh, one of my favorites, because I like to do salt water and fresh water. So again, that's why the reel, I use for those type of reels. It's just, it's easy for me to convert. And the reason I use the braid, again, is because I, I get to convert. Uh, so this this becomes my bass rod for reds, puppy drum, things like that. Um, so it just kind of pairs good. It's 3500 series. So I juggle between 2500 and 3500 series. Um, but yeah, and then with it being pre, coming up to pre-spawn, I kind of just went with the, a heavier, um, leader line instead of like eight pounds i went with about 15 and 20 because i'm throwing more of a power baits and stuff that's about it appreciate it thanks for watching deuce